Today I've got you with the ultimate guide to dropping 20 plus kills on Rebirth Island. Four games, solos, solo duos, solo trios, and solo quads. Each game is a 20 plus kill live commentary where as I'm playing, I'm talking you through my thought process, why I'm doing what I'm doing as a 4KD player, and going over tips and strategies that will allow you to drop 20 plus kill games more often. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you learned something. And if you are looking to get better at Rebirth Island, you are in the right spot. So take a second, make you are subscribed down below okay so as i said we are dropping a 20 plus kill game in every single game mode here solos duos trios and quads starting off in solos here and it's important to understand that i look at these kind of game modes as building blocks solos helps us with solo duos helps us with solo trios helps us with solo quads and look when it comes to solos it's all about two things we don't have to worry about enemy teammates or stacking or anything like that it's about 1v1 and awareness it's about 1v1s and how do we find the next enemy right so you know when we look at it it is going to be all 1v1 fights that guy's going to try to challenge me from but is he going to try to challenge me there was one low here i saw one guy fly in this way mcw maybe one around the corner watch the third party when i say awareness that's what i mean mtz762 one around the corner here maybe I'm just, I have no idea. I'm just going to clear it. No, 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 no. Give me the Renetti. We have the Renetti early. Wait, one right around the corner here. Yep, and we just anticipate that and execute. I did not see where those guys were that were on my level backside this way above okay so the other dynamic of this that we are going to have a ton of fun is uh uavs don't currently work you can't literally cannot use kill streaks saw that guy he pushed up the stairs for real did he have the renetti too yep somebody's on the boat so let's remember that information. Centering, guys, is probably one of the most important things. I'm just going to commit to that hip fire. I'm not even going to worry about it. Enemies are dropping into the area. Watch the skies. This guy's going to try to get back on his stuff. That guy just died from this enemy on the boat. I was ugly. I was ugly, but we won it. That was nice. That was clean. We're we're off to like a crazy start here. We're gonna keep building on this thing. That guy's up top there. Oh wait, I can't call in. I was trying to call in the mosquito drone there. I got to take advantage while people don't have Renetti's. One on the rooftop. I'm going to take Zip. This is a little bit aggressive. This might be a dumb play. I might regret this. This guy's up here somewhere, though. Enemy soldier incoming. Brother, that ain't your loadout. Let's go push these guys. I'm going to clear through the back here. One more to my right side. This is a crazy start. We're just going to keep building because you never know what can happen in this game. I'll tell you that much. That guy... This Renetti is so broken, dude. It's so broken. It's so unfair. But, like, you have to use it. Wait, this guy... Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to try this. Because I low-key have been thinking about this build for a while. Down low. Friendly loadout drops on the way. Where is that guy? That sucks. One down low though. That guy jumped in the water. There was one down low here.
Should I have put the pressure on there? Maybe. I got the assist. This guy's around here, though. Oh my gosh, what a tough gunfight. We were both just playing cover. I really want to drop that into the water. Do I do it? Do I do it? Can he find it? Probably not. One down below over this way. Uh, we don't have enough for a uh, portable. I mean, we're off to an 11 kill start here. We've just been executing literally perfectly. Be careful because somebody's got Yui up. I don't see anybody over here. Where was that orange crate? Might give me a... Like, might get a portable out of it. Can't even use that PA. I, if I don't grab this, you guys are going to scream at me. So, we'll go ahead and grab that now. We're at 11 here early. Come on. We do have enough for portable. I'm a, I still have two loadouts up. We can go challenge all these guys at, uh... Go challenge all these guys at, like, chem. Go fight outside of prison for a little bit. I have not been over here much. I gotta be really smart here. I think I just walked away. I just walked away with two of those. That guy's one -y. There's a bunch of people up top too. Uh, I have a minute here, so I'm going to play this a little bit interesting. I'm going to see if I can get some cheeky angles here. That sucks. Nice. I got that kill. Now, I know they're in... They're in here for sure. Watch this. Watch where I play this from. That's a, that's a good angle to play from. Uh, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to rotate quick. Let's go see if we can capture this 20 now. We've just been playing really, really well. And by the way, guys, this this is... I don't know if I said this, uh, but, you know, I'm not worried about the win here. Obviously, I'm going to try to win. I would love to win, um, especially when it comes to... Dude, that is actually kind of crazy. The guy had high alert. Guaranteed. Watch, he gets high alerted. No? Oh, he just heard us flying in. Okay, um, let's be really smart here. That is my original loadout. That is the original loadout that I threw. Let's go ahead and make sure we uh, get our regain back. We're in a great spot here. I mean, what are we at here? 15 already? And this is where we just... Do. I, guys, I just want to keep the pace up. You know, we're playing strategic. We're obviously... We're, we'll get into the gameplay strategy and everything of this... of. Uh, like solo duos, solo trios, and solo quads here in a minute, but Enemy. this is the guy from earlier. Ten remain. Resurgence window is ending. Watch your six. Enemy UAV overhead. Dude, it's just every freaking gunfight sometimes. Yep, and there's that guy. There's the third party. Had to expect it. Had to expect it. Okay, let's go back in here. We should have another loadout. We've got another loadout here. Uh, here's the only issue. He's going to see me flying in. My only concern here is he's going to actually see me flying in here. So I've got to be really strategic about how I get out of this. I only need four more to clean this thing up. I only need four more to clean this thing up. I know where one of them is. Man, I wish I hadn't used that stim earlier for the speed boost and save it for the health boost. Dude. Fire sales over. Adjusting price. Get me out of here. I need to get up the hill. I need to get up the hill to this buy station here. To my left side. I 
There's plates right here and everything. I just gotta be really careful as I go push this. I want the info. I want the info as I push up here, because this was a bloodbath over this way. Do I want to stay high here? Wait, as crazy as this sounds, watch this. I need four. There's some in tower for sure. See, and this is where the pacing is so important. Because, like, I need four of the last seven. You know, we were on, we were zooming for a while. There's one. There's two back here. Go challenge this guy up top first. Where'd he go? You went right back here. Come on. One guy taking ladder. Let's shut this door here. Nice little third party right there. Trust high alert as we... Wait, I just saw this guy. There's our... Tr our hi Wait, we got trust high alert in the back. And Okay, so one guy on the boat. One guy up top there. Watch. Okay, I know where both of these guys are. This guy's got to rotate to me here. Last one's back behind me. Where? Tower? Where is this guy? There he is. Freaking the same Snoop Dogg skin I've been fighting for half the freaking game. I don't want to go yet. I don't want to go yet. I'm just going to... I'm going to wait for Circle Pull here. I'm going to wait for Circle Pull. He's stuck back here, so... Well, not necessarily. He does have a sniper. I don't have a self-revive. So, just got to be really smart. Let's switch up the angle that we're looking at him from. I don't know if he sees me there. I'm just going to live ping. Let's make our move now. Let's freaking go. And we just wait and wait and wait. Let's go ahead and jump into solo duos, baby. Okay, so now we are jumping into duos here. And look, this is our first step into really learning how to fight outnumbered. If you can't take on a team of two, you're never going to be able to take on a team of three or four. So still doing the live commentary, talking you through my thought process, and really explaining how I go about separating teams and how I change my pace to separate teams. Now, a few things to go over. You know, when it comes to dropping a 20-kill game, which is kind of the whole concept of this video, uh, duos is the hardest game mode. It is hands down the hardest game mode because the lobby just dies out so fast so got to really be aware of that um, we're gonna have to put the pressure on a little bit kind of have to hope the lobby stays healthy might have to farm some teams if you're better than them and kind of leave them alive so that you can get those kills uh, but let's see what we can do here the other thing that i will say is a major difference from the uh the solos gameplay here is the renetti was nerfed in between so we are now using we are back to the good old hrm9 which we've been using for months now but hey, at least it's something that we're familiar with. And I'm sure that'll change at some point here soon. Uh, what are we at here? 6,300. I don't hear anybody around me, to be honest with you. Uh, wait, somebody just flew in. Somebody just flew in. Yeah, one right here. I don't know where his teammate is. Let's go get this thirst. Teammate's above me? Wait, teammate just took zip over here. Where? Right here. I tried to live ping there so I could track him in case he went in the water. So that's like an example of farming. Like I didn't really like, 
Obviously, I tried to put the pressure on there, but I farmed that team because now this guy that's flying in, that's an opportunity for kill number three. Whereas if I do wipe them, it's obviously only two kills. So just something you can do, uh, especially as we get into trio quads and especially as you become a better player, you can start to do it intentionally where you're leaving that last enemy alive. Uh, but sometimes the pacing will just take care of itself and you don't have to worry about it. Uh, kill streaks also work again. So a lot of stuff that's changed from that first game, but... We obviously got good insight into kind of fighting outnumbered. By the way, look, there's only 14 teams left already. Like, there's the bag. Uh, one guy flying in there. I probably should have live pinged him. Enemy mark. Nice. Two flying in there. Okay, so I'm going to go work in here. Mm, yeah, but it looks like a bunch of people over here. I got to be really careful. I'm going to pop that. One more ping. Watch his teammate pushing down. This one right here. Backside. Teammates. There's one guy still on the roof here, or up top. He might be second or third floor. That guy's teammate is further back in living quarters. But I picked that up. Okay, so that PA is going to hit me, but he's got to go inside here. Ah! Yeah, I was going to say, there's... Watch that guy pushing him from back behind me, though. We pressure on this guy. Oh my gosh. Where's your teammate? Right there. Okay, we're good. He re-challenged that really well. I mean, he kind of had to, but it's not Renetti world anymore. We have to be a little bit less concerned about that. So there you see just a little bit of farming. I didn't farm that like crazy. Wait, this might be two teams down here. If it's two teams, I kind of want to go. Uh, let me see what I can find on Yui here real quick. Let me soldier incoming. I think I have like... Uh... What's this guy doing? One guy over this way. Is this a mistake to go challenge based on this? Up the hill. Yeah, we just hit fire there with the HRM. I got that was a really bad play. But you see, I get I put the pressure on the the Black Noir skin before because he look he can't do anything right. He's flying in. He obviously has no guns. Even if he does have loadout guns, he's low played. So I'm trying to capture that and really take advantage of that while I have the information. This guy's in the second floor here. This guy's back on his stuff for sure. This might be two. Nope, only one. And that was just perfect centering around that corner. Duos tends to be a little bit less sweaty than other game modes. It can definitely be sweaty at times, uh, but it, it can be a little bit less sweaty than trios and quads. Uh, we're at 10 here. One thing we didn't really talk about much in solos is pacing, guys. You know, pacing in solos and duos, you got to be a little bit quicker. I mean, that game in solos, I started out with 10 kills in the first or something and finished with what? I finished with like... I think there's ghosted players here. I finished with 22, I think, but I... Th I Wait, there's definitely people floating around here. Just be careful as I turn this corner here. I don't know where his teammate is. I finished with 22 there. I had like 10 in the first. It's huge. This guy's flying in. Go ahead and take that. I gotta reload. There's the re knock on the one of them. I just choked. I just, my slide cancel. I just hit a dead slide. That's so frustrating, man. That's so frustrating. And I don't even get that full kill. We're at, that's crazy that I don't get that full kill. Let's see what we got here. There were teams over here on the loadout. This is gonna be a little bit aggressive here, but we're going. 
Just be ready to move. Alright, I could take the zip up. That sucks, man. Team got just... I just hit that dead slide around the corner where I just missed my slide. But I had him where I wanted him. I had him in a good spot. Those guys are dropping down. Wait, please don't have high alert. Please don't have high alert. No. I just shot way too early. These guys are going to push roof. Most likely. There was the first. Where's your teammate? Teammates down below. Pushing across. That's under. Okay, so another team here for sure. There's that guy. This guy's flying in over this way. where these guys are right around the corner here I just fought through that so hard now nah, we're gonna do this though we're not gonna play him straight up he should he he's not gonna have his stuff because his stuff is is in this little bridge area. I should be able to hit Yui here. Requesting recon flyover. Where's your teammate? Where's that one guy's teammate? Wait, they're over this way. We need three here. These guys are pushing a big. These guys had good shots. We just waited for that guy. I just waited for him. He was dancing. I didn't need to dance. Only four remain. Finish the job. Oh, like only four remain. That's crazy. One up top here. Okay, that's a big. That's a big kill. Now we're in a one v two situation. One v two, fourth circle, and then we're going into solo trios. Top prison. Top prison. Let's go figure out how we're going to fight this team. I'm watching where they're moving to. They're not moving towards me, right? We see them moving away. They jumped on buy station. Okay, last one's right down here. I almost just sold that. Another 22. Let's go ahead and jump into solo trios. Okay, so as I said, now we are jumping into trios, which is that next building block. And this is where we can start to get into dropping those consistent higher kill games. You know, trios and quads are definitely the easier game modes to drop 20s. And quads is the easiest. Trios is kind of lobby dependent. It can die out pretty quickly. I don't know why that is. It didn't happen in Warzone 1. But, you know, we talk about building blocks, guys. We're, we're still sticking with the same thing. I think of my trios as solo duo fights, you know. We need to play patient. We need to get that first down in thirst, at which point we get the information. Now, from there, this is what changes. If we see that there's two enemies that very close together, then we play patient. And we kind of play that as a situation where it's like, hey, 
we you know we had a solo duo situation we shot at them and unfortunately you know they kind of know where we are so we got to reposition find a different angle and stuff like that if we get the down and thirst and they're split and it, i see a 1v1 fight like i'm gonna take it i'm gonna immediately take that what do we got here this sucks these guys are close here i don't know what level these guys are on that's the problem just like i said i don't know what level these guys are on because of this stupid bird's eye vest this is why you don't run bird's eye I, I, and you can't drop it. Second one's right behind him. He's broken. I heard him pushing. I'm just going to hold this until... There we go. Okay, those guys are further back there. Uh, I'm going to back off here and see if I can get load out back this way. Nice little start there. Nice little, you know, little bit sweaty is what it is. We rock and roll. I've really played that. I played that perfectly. Just a really good change of pace there. So, guys, if we get... Like I said... Oh, my gosh. One straight ahead. There's a guy straight ahead of me there. Dude, how do I, I, I just, you gotta be able to drop that, <laughs> and I get another, another one. Literally, if I gotten anything else there, I would've been fine. No, I didn't, I didn't catch him. I'm gonna play roof here. Uh, these guys are getting PA'd. Two very close together. gonna be tough to get this nope because he i look pressure's on them pressure's on them at that point i got the down you know they've got to figure out how they're going to get their revive off if they can it's not on me i can just i can kind of ha i have time on my side dude i like really 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 am trying to get rid of this vest I gotta be really careful here. Nice. Wait, one back behind me up top. He's up top. He's on this third floor here. And then I gotta go throw plates. You know what's crazy? If he had actually just freaking... If he had just shot his gun there, he probably would have... Wow. Guy's so close to being dead. We're off to a great start here, too. This is just a... S Let's throw plates down. I'm going to back off this team. Back off this team. Let's go work back this way a little bit. We'll take zip. Uh, that team is obviously, like, starting to get very close together because I kind of put them in the spin cycle a little bit, so... Yeah, and I forced I forced him that way. Wait. Okay. There, there were people over this way here. That can't happen. Nice. This guy's straight across here. Look, and look, oh, we're just separate. Oh, yes, finally. We're just separating teams really, really well right now. We are separating them so well.
But you know what the biggest difference is? And I think this is something that obviously has to be said is like, let's hit ammo crate, uh, is the execution component, right? There is no, you know, that's like the most important thing at the end of the day. It's like, you gotta, you gotta, gotta, gotta execute. Um, it's also the hardest part, you know, it's, you gotta, you give teams windows, they're going to take them. I haven't given anybody a window yet. My loadout looks jam packed, which is going to be a blast. You know, Flanking one enemy here. there, yeah, one enemy on my out. level inside here, front door. No, I looked away for half a second to check it right before I was about to go push. Can I get load out here? Returning you to the front. Earn this. Oh, no, here's how we're going to regain. I killed two guys over here. And one of the most important parts, yep. So he has a Renetti and a Moors. That's not exactly what I want. One of the most important parts of trios is you've got to get back into the action quick. He's got a Holger 26 and a WSP9. That'll get the job done for now. Uh, let's go ahead and drop down here for a second. We'll go ahead and throw portable. Um, I'm going to be a... I don't know if this is a bad play or not, but I'm going to try to take this little gondola thing. Try to get into prison a little bit easier, a little bit quicker. Or I'm not going to try to take it. That works too. Didn't want to take that anyway. I'll be honest with you. Man, I just can't believe the COD timing there. But we regained well. Uh, I'll, I'll leave load out there. I got to get back in and try to get my stuff. And we're in a good spot to do that because these guys should all just be chilling in grandma's. Kind of take the same exact route. I mean, what are all these guys doing? Uh, might as well throw this down, right? Let's go ahead and uh, see what we can find here. That guy's 20. Would have been free. We're at 12 here. Wait, there's a guy on the roof. Definitely a guy on the roof. That guy in Grandma's just got sniped by him. I want to be really strategic here. This lobby's staying healthy, so we're still in a really good spot here. We just need four kills. I don't know where he got sniped from. I got to be careful of tower here. There were so many people over here. Give me inside. Where is this guy sniping from? Tower. I just, I, my pace is getting crushed because of these people. There's a thirst. Where are you at? These guys all have to jump, though. So, like, I kind of just want to, like, play this strategic. Ah, fire sales done. Prices are back to normal. Enemies deployed a counter UAV. Like, I kind of... There's one right there. Like, Dave... Where are these guys? This guy's on the roof. Marked remaining operators from that squad. Hunt them down. Resurgence has closed. No more second chances. Okay, so one all the way over there. One above me. Need five here to clutch the twenty. Perfect. Let's do it. Let's challenge this guy first. Be very careful of our cover here. He just dropped down. I gotta get out of here. After doing that and that. 
And let's go buy and gas mask. Yep, let's get some. Uh, just give me a little bit of info here as I, you know, finish this game here. That's a little bit aggressive, but I knew that they were like all they were. They were scattered. They were in a pretty tough spot there. Uh, let me see what I can find here. I technically, oh, we get another freaking, we get another portable. That's clutch. So we get to see what's happening on this side of the map too. Nobody above me here. I should go up, hundred percent. Let's just get up top here and play play our roof. Uh, watch these guys to the right side here. Yeah, I'm in a great spot. No. Jailbreak. I gotta be careful this jailbreak. What do we need? We need two. There's one. Okay, so literally I just need the last kill, but okay, so watch the skies here. We're gonna PA that. Copy that, Phoenix two. Enemies dropping into the AO. I'm gonna push up this way. I thought I had stims for sure. I know he's close. No, I died. I 21. We'll take the 21. I just forgot to reload. Or I just tried to. Oh, he live pinged me. That sucks. Okay, let's go to jump into quads. Okay, so now we are jumping into quads here. And look, the end of that trios game, it is what it is, guys. I probably should have gave up my spot in prison and jumped down low, replayed it, repositioned, kind of figured out how, I, how to get back in the circle and put myself in a better spot. But decided to challenge, made a really good play, ended up winning that 1v1. But I went with that game for a reason. I had a 29 kill solo trio win in a you know body or lobby. But when I showed you, I felt like it was sweatier. I had to execute better and I didn't win. I wanted to show you that like, hey, we cannot win a game and still drop 20 if we get off to a good start and keep that momentum throughout mid-game. Now, in terms of quads, guys, you better buckle up. Buckle up with an AMR9, baby. It's a good start. You know, guys, quads is everything that we've talked about, but on another level. Bunch above me here. I just don't know where. Is it roof? There's two. One right here. One above. I mean, you guys want to talk about, like, you've got to... Your execution, your pacing, your ability to look, see the next 1v1 and catch information on radar. By the way, I'm posting this no matter what, probably. Like, what, if we drop a 20 in this, it's getting posted. It doesn't have to be a win. It doesn't have to be a great game. That sucks. Where are these guys? Check in here, maybe? No. Wait, that guy had a gun. These guys are right above me here. What are these guys doing? You guys are all right above me here. I really don't want to go challenge that. I'd rather just keep third partying people. And we're in a great spot here. 
You gonna challenge? Nope. Let's go get loadout down. Okay, that's unnecessary. Where'd you go? I want to leave that loadout up. I have no interest in... in I mean, where do I go from here? I really should go challenge this boat guy because he's being annoying. But I feel like... Oh, watch PA. What are we at here? Six early? Yeah, still a... I think there's a bunch of people up top here still. Enemy soldier incoming. Our guardians lost power. Hostiles the mosquito. Bunch down below me. Give me the stims. Tempered. Where's that guy flying in? No. There's somebody in here, too. No. 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 Holy smokes. This guy's right on my loadout here. Frick, dude. Holy smokes. Still so many people around here. I was going to say, there's a bunch of people up top there. Oh, here we go again. I just get out of here. He's going to chase me, 100%. Gas is oh, they're all pushing a crossover to me. Oh, man, we're playing so well here. This might go on... If I hit 20 here, this is going on YouTube no matter what. Still a bunch of people here. Bunch of people straight across. That's a full team.
Where's your teammates? The frick is happening, dude. I don't like that team. What do we need? Three? Holy smokes. Uh, where are we going here? Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Fire sales over. Adjusting prices. There's one to my right side here. Yeah, we're gonna go challenge that immediately. You better believe it. I'm still running around with this guy's original loadout guns. We might break it. We might have to break this game down too. I got 20 here. My hands are so shaky. I'm a little nervous here. I have no self revive. That sucks. I mean, I could just sit in this building for a little bit. I'm just gonna chill in here. I mean, this probably isn't where I want to be long term, so I'm probably gonna have to loot up here. Let's see if I can get maybe a gas mask. You know what? I might as well just keep looting. See if I can set myself up for endgame. See if I get like a gas mask or something. Nah, we're not gonna be able to. I mean, there's gonna be a bunch of people up the hill for sure. What perks do I have here? Nah, I need to be in the building. Wait, throwing knives. Ah. Uh, I might, I don't know what I want to do here. Might try to get roof. I gotta reload. I'm in a little bit of a weird spot. definitely going to be people yeah there's so many down there's definitely people above and below i kind of just want to win this though or do i just keep going there's no way i'm getting rooftop here like i'm a solo player there's like how many teams on the roof Pretty bad circle pull for me, actually. Ground, 
Problem is, if all of these guys push me at once, there's nothing that I can do. Enemy soldier incoming. I mean, there's just... I'm just gonna be dead here. There's just nothing that... dead i told you that it's just that's it's such a bad circle pull i can't do anything but we take the 24 just a really good game all the way around I, there's unless i had a gas mask there there's nothing i could do i mean i just it, let's go ahead and spectate it out here for fun now nah, actually we're gonna call it there guys i hope you enjoyed today's video ultimate guide to dropping a 20 plus kill game on rebirth island as i always say let's get better today and i will see you tomorrow